Yo, what up guys, Mikey Mini here, and today guys, I have, a, I have another video for you guys, sorry I've been, been uploading for so long, I've been, you know, doing some schoolwork, but otherwise guys, I have, I have one of the best videos I've ever done, and that is the best settings for this current Battlefront 2, and guys, I'm guaranteeing you right now, these are the best settings, cause I don't know what what's the best settings, but guys, I know this is for fact the best settings I have, you know, found out about, so, Guys, stay tuned. Watch the whole thing. I have definitely some more information about the best settings, the best sensitivity, what stick dead zone you guys should be in, and a lot more. So, you guys, here we go with the video. So, guys, what number one tip? Turn down your sensitivity. Guys, I cannot stress enough. When you play with a sensitivity that is 100%, you guys will be moving your stick all over the place. You guys will be missing those shots. And, you know you keep dying so that's why I'm telling you guys right now turn down your sensitivity turn it down to a 20 or a 21 I play on 20 and by far it's been the best sensitivity for me at least you guys can check it out and see which one best suits for you so guys my next other tip for you guys is definitely definitely turn off aim assist the reason why I say this cause the game the aim assist only kicks in when a player is not moving. So if the player is not moving that much, it starts to like react. But if the player is moving constantly, it will kind of work, but at the same time it won't. So guys, when I shoot a player who is moving, it the radical sign keeps slowing down. And so I miss a lot of shots. So I have to force my character to aim a little bit ahead. So that's why I turned off aim assist because the radical sign was too slow to react so I turned off aim assist and guys he made a, a lot of difference guys so you guys should definitely check it out turn off aim assist and let me let me guys know how it worked for you guys and I'll be sure to let you guys know like I don't know aim assist in this game is really controversial it's good in certain situations but at the same time it's not so for me I turned off aim assist guys and I think you guys you should try it out. It's, it's, it's gonna be a lot of you know, guys gonna hit a lot of more shots than you did before. So my next final tip for you guys is definitely, definitely turn down your stick dead zone all the way. I don't know why they put this in the game, but if you pull your stick dead zone to a hundred percent, your controller will be I can't even explain. It will basically take more longer. React so if you move if you move your joysticks around when you put it at a hundred percent, the joysticks will keep moving really slow and it will have a longer reaction time. So guys, I don't know why they put it in the game, but definitely turn the around turn the down to zero, completely zero, no twenty percent, no twenty one, just completely zero. And guys. For the full recap of the video, I'll be putting all the settings on the screen right now. And guys, you can copy those settings down and I'll be sure guys to let you guys know if there's any certain changes in the game. I know there won't be, but these are the settings, current settings in the game right now. And it has been working out for me so, so much guys. So if I missed anything guys, let me know in the comments down below. You guys were awesome in the last video. Let me know some things in the comments i was really happy for that and yeah thank you guys for watching be sure to hit the like button and subscribe if you're new to this channel honestly guys thank you guys for all your support throughout the weeks i'm really appreciative and yeah christmas is almost here guys let's get let's get cheerful and yeah thank you guys for watching i'll be showing another video after this one but yeah thank you guys for watching take care and i'll see you guys in the next video may the force be with you